Hi, Hi Patriots. Patriots! I'm Kyle Krimquist, your student council president. And I'm Cooper Kramer, this year's treasurer. Kyle and I have been involved in student council since our freshman year. We love our school and we know that the end of our time here is quickly approaching. We wanted to give you some important information as we wind down the year and get ready to say goodbye. You've probably noticed that we are in the midst of election season for next year's offices. More of you voted in the executive officers' races last Wednesday than in recent memory, and that's amazing. Thank you so much for voting. This Tuesday, you'll have the chance to vote again on the special runoff ballot. A runoff occurs when no candidate in a race gets at least 50% of the vote, so a new election takes place between the top two vote getters. We have runoffs for the office of SCA president, SCA secretary, and senior class president. Daly Sembrowich and Loring Spencer are vying to be president of the entire student body. Will Henning and Sidney Sneer are contending for secretary, and Lucas Rambo and Chertal St. Luce both want to lead the senior class. This has been an exciting election season. We have had over 30 diverse and amazing students run for office, and that's so exciting. Our school is growing and changing, and we want our student government to represent all kids here. We need all of your voices heard, so please vote on Tuesday. You'll get a link in your school email during B Block. For four years, we have dedicated our time and energy uniting our Patriot community, improving the quality of our relationships with each other and with our stu students and staff and making our experiences here as memorable and positive as possible. possible. As we prepare to leave AHS for the next steps in our journey, we ask you sincerely to keep a few things in mind. First, be good to each other. We are one big family and we may not always get along, but we're always connected. Second, remember what you do represents our school community as a whole. That includes how we act in school and out of school, in person and online. And third, our school is the flagship school of Albemarle County. AHS is constantly ranked as one of the finest schools in Virginia, and we're even ranked in America. We're finishing up in the 65th school year in this place. Thousands of people in our area and across the country and world call themselves Albemarle Patriots. And it's up to us to keep this incredible legacy going for another 65 years. Finally, we want to thank you all for what you do, day in and day out, to be your best and help others achieve theirs. Be encouraged next year to find even more ways to get involved. Find a club, uh, try, to try out for a sport, run for office, or start your own movement. SCA is here to support you. Every student, no matter their GPA, race, religion, or social status, is welcome and has a place here at Albemarle. Thank you, Albemarle, Albemarle and, remember, and remember, once a patriot, always a patriot. Patriots. Patriots. I'm Cinderella. And I'm Prince Charming, and today is Tuesday, April 30th. Here are your morning announcements. Patriots, this week is Chillax Week. Stress is a real thing, especially this time of year. In an effort to help us all relax and enjoy school, there are several events planned. Many teachers have fun activities during Patriot period and lunch from Dungeons and Dragons Tuesday and Ooh. Thursday to Chuke Ball on Wednesday. The culinary arts class is serving us lunch on Wednesday and ice cream will be, ab be available in the breezeway outside Mrs. Schrader's class on Thursday at lunch. SCA will have bubbles and sidewalk chalk on the breezeway daily as well as cornhole Tuesday. Thursday is comfy day, so wear your best school appropriate relaxed mm -hmm. gear. Friday is flip-flop slash beach day. Please stop by the SCA office if you have any questions. If you are interested in applying for the National Social Studies Honor Society, please submit the Google form by May 3rd. There will be a QR code on the flyers and the link will be written on a board in Mr. Phil's room. Contact Ms. Astrid Wisend with any questions. Attention current AHS members and new NHS inductees. NHS initiation has been moved to Wednesday, May 8th at 4.30. Please check your email for more information. The Spanish Honor Society is accepting applications from all students who have completed or are currently enrolled in Spanish 3 or higher. Highlights of a society membership include participation in charitable acts, fun events centered around Hispanic culture, the chance to grow your Spanish in new ways and engaging ways. The application is due today. Young liberals will have Sally Hudson, Democratic candidate for the 57th District House of Delegate Seat, come in and talk to us about her candidacy on Thursday, May 2nd during Patriot Period in Room 152. Come on down and ask questions. All are welcome to bring a friend. Cinderella, I, I thought our elected officials weren't elected at all, but instead decided through bloodline. Oh. 
Uh, anyway. Well, uh, attention! If you are thinking about auditioning for the Nofella Acapella group, the interest meeting tomorrow is May 1st during Patriot Period in the Choir Room. Go Minutemen! We love Nofella. This week, Culinary Arts has three events that we wanted to let everyone know about on May 1st. We will be taking over one of the lunch lines. On May 2nd and May 3rd, students will be competing in the AHS Cupcake Wars. I love cupcakes. I do too. Wow. And on May 4th, Culinary Arts 2 will be teaming up with the Drama Department to bring you dinner and a show. If you have any questions, contact Mr. Poindexter. We love dinner theater. Me too. In sports news, last night the girls' soccer team swept Monticello 3-0. Hoorah! The boys also played last night against Monticello and beat them with a score of 6-1. Good job, Patriots! That's all for now. Have, Have a, a great, great day! day.